Students generally get confused about the sign of the velocity. It can be positive, it can be negative. What does that mean? By convention, when the velocity sign is negative, your object is moving towards the left. If the velocity sign is positive, your object is moving towards the right. When velocity is equal to zero, your object is at rest, it's not moving. Look at this graph of velocity and time and look at the time interval zero up to A. At time zero, your object is at rest, but then it starts moving. Based on the negative velocity values, your object is moving entirely towards the left. There's a portion of the curve where the velocity is increasing, then there's that portion where the velocity is decreasing as your object will hit the rest position and stop again at time A. Now focus at the time interval A to B. Now your object is moving again, but it's moving entirely towards the right. The velocity will increase all the way up to the end of that interval B. Keep in mind velocity signs, positive and negative, has to do with vectors and think of it in that way.